So I'm going to be talking about today is your weight loss journey in the beginning. Um, the steps that you need to take to begin your weight loss journey so you can lose some weight. Um, I'm Paige, by the way. <clears throat> I'm on a weight loss journey. I had gained weight over the years. Um, I used to be thin and I ended up gaining all this weight and you know I looked back and I realized what I did that made me gain the weight of course so I go I hope you guys have a pen and paper um, I do I have some stuff written down because I want to remember everything and this is for you to start beginning your weight loss journey and I am going to take some ally I heard some things good things about ally and some bad things too so I'm going to start taking that hopefully in a few weeks. I'm going to see if my doctor can prescribe me um, some um, Zenical instead of Ally so because I can't afford it. And so let's start with the beginning. Okay, so do you guys have a pen and paper? I hope so. So here's how I started out. I lost 25 pounds so far from just doing this and not taking Ally. So, okay, so... Let's write, um, what are your favorite fruits? So I have tons of favorite fruits that I love. I love apples, pomegranates, strawberries and stuff. <coughs> and my recommendation is you buy the fruits you love. And write down some fruits that you love and buy them continuously so it becomes a habit that you always buy them and you eat them. And so... I'm gonna, I kind of bounce around, sorry about that. So the beginning of, okay, so just think about what your, what your favorite fruits are and write them down and, you know, whatever. So also, too, um, for the beginning of my weight loss journey, I had cut out completely all juice, all, I had never drank pop really, but I, I drink a lot of juice and it still has a lot of sugar. <coughs> and so I decided to cut out everything um, for juice. I drink some milk, but not very much. And what I drink is flavored water at the moment because I cannot handle water. I, you know, I know how it feels, you know, but try to replace, you know, I have a flavored water, zero everything. I'm assuming it's not that great as either, but it's better than taking and taking the calories of juice and all the sugar so that's what I do is flavored water you can get water bottles and water packets for you know to make it flavorful so if you don't enjoy water but I do recommend cutting out all juices and drinking water because you do not need the juices or any of that stuff so second of all um, 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 what I mean for my weight loss when I, I exercise three times a week at the gym. I have a Wii Fit 2 at home, but I know um, you don't exactly, if you don't have a gym membership and you don't have a Wii Fit, <coughs> I recommend walking a half hour every day. Um, in January, I'm going to start walking and exercising a half hour at least every day. You only have to do a half hour, so it's no big deal. At least it gets your metabolism going and helps you with all that stuff. So I recommend that you do a half hour, even a walk. Walk Walking makes a difference, trust me. And also, um, I recommend, um, you know, jumping jacks. Like, say you smoke. I smoke. I shouldn't. I recommend you to quit, definitely. Um, but I go outside to smoke. Because it moves. I get moving. And if you smoke and you just smoke inside, I recommend you just to take the time and go outside. Even though it's bitter cold, you know, just get some gloves on and that gets you moving. You're moving and using muscles and all that stuff. So, so I hope you wrote down some fruits that you like. Now our next goal is to write down some veggies. <laughs> and I hate veggies. The only two veggies I like is spinach and green beans. And I understand how people would not like veggies. So write down some veggies you like, even though it's even if it's one or two, I it doesn't matter. And when you 
write down that veggie, buy it, because you love it so much. You love that veggie, and <clears throat> buy it and eat it as a snack. You know, I eat spinach all the time for dinner. I love spinach. And um, so just do that, and I'll talk about more um, about cutting out foods. Um, I eat a lot of frozen foods before. Um, corn dogs, you know, all the fruits and hot pockets, not stuff that is good for you at all. So I completely stopped buying hot pockets and pizza rolls and all that stuff. I just stopped. I just, I said, no, this is over. So instead, I replaced it with um, basics such as, you know, Bread isn't good for you, but I love bread and I'm still working on that. So this is the beginning This is for everyone that's starting out. So don't feel bad if you're still not cutting out certain foods or not replacing them with better stuff So I do eat bread. Um, I replace it with sandwiches and um, I buy a lot of bananas. I love bananas. I just I eat them all day, you know and fruits have so much antioxidants and so good for you. There's kiwis you know, I love them all. And um, two peanut butter and crackers I switched to because it's just a small, you know, snack that's better. Now, this is the beginning, so don't judge me because this is how you start out is just cutting out the basics that you always eat. Now, I hope you wrote down some veggies. So, <clears throat> and I talked about cut out the bad and replace it with veggies or other stuff like cut it out completely if you buy it you're gonna eat it if you don't buy it you're not gonna eat it so don't buy it if you know it's bad for you so let's write down what are five things that you eat the most now I'm sorry this video is taking a little longer I hope you enjoy and watch it because this is the beginning you need to know it all I'm gonna make a video um, a couple weeks before and see if I'm on the ally to Tell you all about that and stuff so and what are five things you eat the most and it doesn't have to be five it could be more than five or less than five but five things that you eat the most and then I want you to do the research and those five things you eat are they good for you or are they bad for you are they are they high in cal are they high in fat are they are they, you know, if they're good for you, keep eating them, you know, but if it's bad for you, don't eat it. <clears throat> cut it out completely. Like I said, I cut out all the frozen food and it was unbelievable. I didn't believe, and I cut out juice and I lost 25 pounds from that. Even, you know, with exercising three times a week, which in January, I'm going to start exercising a half hour at least every day. So I have a gym membership and a Wii Fit. Um... Two, this is, you know, this is all I really have to say. Um, it's just, I hope that this can help you in the beginning, you know, by cutting out food, finding your fruit and veggies that you like the most and that you can buy and eat and enjoy. Because I don't like a lot of veggies and I can't enjoy them. If I buy them, I'm not going to eat them. So I just, green beans and spinach is what I buy to eat um, good food, you know, as a veggie. And, you know, cut out juice. You don't need juice. You need water. You know, we, we live off water. We're 70% we're water. So, you know, and this is the beginning. So just take it slow. Cut out a lot of the stuff that is very unhealthy. If you're a sweet eater, you know, I recommend, um, you know, if you eat sweets, leave 25% of the sweet behind. So say you're eating a cookie, only eat three-fourths of the cookie and then throw it away. Um, it's no big deal. Don't make those rumors about, oh, there's kids starving in Africa. Don't let those get to you. Um, some of it's true, some of it's not, and it, there's no real, real, you know, statistic about it. So you can't really know for sure. So if you're not, if you don't like to throw away food, just throw it away. You know, don't make a big fuss about it. It's no big deal. Um, they complain all the time about throwing away food, but it's like, you know what, then don't make so much, you know. <laughs> so, comment below. Um, I know I don't look my best. Obviously, I gained the weight. I wish I could, you know, look better. And that's why I've lost the 25 pounds, just by cutting out food and exercising three times a week. So, please, please, this is your beginning to your weight loss journey. So, 
write down the things I said and the th five things you eat most, you know, research them and look at the calories and look at, you know, are they good for you or are they not, you know, and start replacing stuff slowly at a time, you know, you don't, you can do it all at once, I don't care, just, just get that bad stuff for you out of your house. If you don't buy it, you won't eat it. So I'm going to make a post, <laughs> excuse me, I'm going to make a post um, a couple weeks from now and see if I can get on that Ally or Xanacal and see if that can help. So I'll make a post about that and I'll start updating you. This is for the beginning of your weight loss journey and you need, you, some people need a push, you know, some people need help. So I hope this helped. Um, sorry for the long video. I know it's only 10 minutes or 11 minutes. So, um, comment below and let me know if you want to know not know anything but what you think I guess if, if it's helped you in any way because I really am not an expert on anything so alright thank you you guys have a good day bye